I am Gérard Aro, I'm the French ambassador to the United States. For me, to, to summarize my country in one word would be, would be to say creativity. Uh, I, I really do believe that uh, France has been creative all over his, uh, his, her history. Uh, of course, it's very easy to go back to, to French art, uh, especially during the 19th century, paintings, literature. Uh, but what is striking right now, and I, I do see it every time I'm traveling throughout uh, the United States, is also the creativity of our engineers. Uh, very often when you, you say to the people what is France, they think of Versailles, they think of the, the cuisine, and, and actually that's France also. But I think we should think also of our incredible engineers who are so successful in France, but also in the US. The France of today uh, is the eternal France on one side. Uh, Versailles is still there. Uh, Notre Dame de Paris is still there. Our restaurants are still the best ones in the world. Uh, the French women are still the most elegant in the world. But uh, France is also modernizing. And uh, by electing a, a young president, a 39 years old president, we have sent a very strong signal. France is modernizing. France is going into the 21st century. I think a lot of Americans don't know that France is the oldest ally of the United States. Uh, we have been always uh, side by side with our American friends when we have been fighting, uh, you know, the enemies of, of liberty. And today's again, the French and the Americans side by side are fighting terrorism in Africa or in the Levant. Our alliance is stronger than ever. The fact is France is the first uh, touristic uh, area in the world. Uh, 87 million of people are visiting France. Uh, there is of obviously a very good reason. They are not crazy. It's simply that France is the most attractive place that you can go, that you can study, that you can work. So, bienvenue en France. <laughs>